Hello, I'm Julian Henderson, the Bishop of Blackburn. My name's Jill Smith, I'm Vision Champion at All Saints High Walton Church. Hi, I'm Dave Champness, I'm the Vision Coordinator for the Diocese. I've been hugely encouraged by the way in which uh, parishes have taken up the challenge of Vision 2026 and particularly having somebody to represent uh, Vision 2026 locally in each of these uh, local Christian communities. So that's been a wonderful encouragement and I look forward to others coming and joining the team as well. And Joe, why did you decide to become a Vision Champion? Well, um, it was actually a role that was suggested to me uh, by somebody initially um, and I didn't say yes immediately. I wanted to, to go away and think about it. I think oftentimes, certainly with myself when, and I know with a lot of other people, when God calls us to do something or, or puts a task in our heart and mind, um, we can sometimes kind of think, is there someone better for the role? Um, will I have enough time? Am I best qualified? So I went away and spent some time um, to think about it and pray about it and actually read a couple of pieces of scripture that convinced me that you know this was what God wanted me to do um, but also that he would um, be there helping me to do it. That's great and when you look forward now to the next few months towards Crossroads does that excite you about what we're planning to do in September from the 8th to the 11th? Yeah I think very much so. I think it's quite a concentrated amount of time you know the Thursday to to the Sunday um, and what's quite exciting about it is that you know we're planning as a parish um, these these mission events that we're going to be doing but it's also the thought that we're going to be part of something much bigger so that during that weekend you know it's not just us but you know mm. so many different parishes across the diocese that are all um, actively engaged in mission together for that weekend and that's what's exciting for us about it but also that you know for us as a parish, we're looking at um, building on our youth work and engaging with our youth throughout that weekend to extend you know, invitations to, to other children outside of our church. Um, and that's what's exciting you know, for us as a mm. parish about it too. That's mm. terrific. And mm. Dave, mm. you must be very encouraged with the way the churches are engaging now with the Vision Champion ethos going across the diocese. Oh, absolutely. It's great to have met so many of the Vision Champions during April when we've had some informal evenings at uh, Bishop Jeff and Bishop Phillips homes uh, we've had opportunity to spend time studying uh, the God's Word together to understand a little bit more about what the uh, role of the vision champion is and also to spend some time in prayer for each other uh, which I think is a really mm. important part of, of the role as a vision champion because we're not doing this in our own strength we're doing it uh, in God's strength mm -hmm. and it's also been really helpful that we've started to have some good ideas as how we can kind of keep in touch with uh, the vision champions the vision champions can keep in touch with each other to to share some really good ideas and uh, spend time uh, mm -hmm. looking at each other's what, what each other do in each of their parishes and saying actually this might work for us and that for me is, is really really exciting mm. And now we're able to have a very special message from uh, our visitor, uh, the Archbishop of York, who's coming to join us with other bishops from all over the Northern Province to share in the, the Crossroads 2016 mission in September. Dearly beloved in Christ, especially those of you who are gathered at the Guild Hall, greeting in the name of a risen and ascended Lord Jesus Christ. This amazing crossroads mission in the Diocese of Blackburn, uh, September 8th to the 11th, uh, 2016, a four days mission. What a fantastic opportunity. A fantastic opportunity for us to be more confident about the gospel of Jesus Christ, but more so to pray that we will be mightily filled with the Holy Spirit because the Holy Spirit is the director of mission. We saw this in the Diocese of Sheffield last year when we had a similar crossroads mission and that diocese is building on what God the Holy Spirit did. We were just simply being obedient to the voice that together as bishops in mission we should visit a diocese and together share the love of God in Jesus Christ. So friends, Crossroads Mission for Blackburn Diocese in 2016 is about inviting people like we've been invited by Jesus Christ to follow him and to be given new life. New life, very much like that of Jesus. 
and then seeing people daily being transfigured, being transformed into Christ-likeness. Is there a better thing than that? D.N.T. Niles put it beautifully. We are beggars telling other beggars where we have found bread, bread of life, which is Jesus Christ. So please, I urge you from now until then, pray daily to be renewed in the power of the Spirit, to get God's love rekindled in your heart. What is important is not that we will set the Diocese of Blackburn on fire, but that we ourselves are so much on fire that if we are thrown into water, we will sizzle. May the Lord bless you most heartily and most warmly, and I look forward to coming to be part of that wonderful Crossroads mission where we are going to see the Holy Spirit doing a new thing in our midst. To God be the glory, now and forever.